Good morning everybody and welcome back to the channel. So uh, it has gotten really, really cold outside. It is, it was zero degrees when we woke up this morning and uh, we tried to actually work yesterday and took all day just to get two pieces of equipment to move. So we decided, well, we're going to uh, work in the shop today and uh, continue the uh, shop office project and break room and bathroom. So our next step with this was to start painting. So Dad, Strength, and I, and Dad, have spent the morning in here painting. We uh, got this real pretty gray color here. It turned out real nice. I think it looks nice, don't you? Mm -hmm. So we are by no means professional painters. Uh, there's drywall dust rolling in front of the roller, and uh, Wilson occasionally walks in here and wipes his butt right on the wall when he turns around. But uh, we we can do a good enough job to make it look fairly good. I don't know. It's good enough to hang pictures on. Yeah, good enough. We can hang some pictures over the imperfections, and uh, and make her look good. Which we have plenty of pictures. We're gonna hang in here. Uh, we're gonna take one wall probably, and we're gonna do a whole uh, picture wall of projects and tractors that we've had, tractors that we still have and uh, actually make like uh what would you call that a collage, a collage i suppose yeah just a, a memory wall i suppose you could and i've got a light up gleaner sign that i'm gonna hang in here and stuff so uh it's gonna turn out real nice so i give you a little update because uh well the new ones to the channel don't know the whole story here um what we done last year was we added 48 foot by what did we go 20 that was it 20 yeah we went 48 foot long 20 wide <clears throat> the length of the building and then we we went the 20 wide uh, that gave us a good size parts area to keep extra tools parts and filters and stuff like that and then it gave us this break room and it gave us an office and then on the back side of the office we have a small bathroom it was space that we really needed and we filled it up quick. I mean, the, the new addition in there is full already. So uh, it's been an ongoing project. We work on it every time we get a little time. The main goal was, was to get the more shop space. And then the, we kind of just let the office and break room area kind of go. We've just stored random stuff in here, like all my brochures and, and uh, books and stuff just kind of sat in here. But the ultimate goal is, is we're going to Put a few cabinets in that corner, kind of make a like just a little kitchenette area. The, the refrigerator is going to go over there, and then we're going to put some bookshelves in uh, to put all our shop manuals and just random books that we have. And then what I really want to do, and Dad Strength agrees with it, if we can get Dad on board with it, I want to put a train track around the ceiling with the train. I think that'd be really neat. So kind of a place come in here sit down and just watch train go around a little bit and I've also thought about uh, actually making the office into my YouTube studio also because I don't have good internet at home so I figured I could utilize mom and dad's internet get me a good computer to do my editing just do it all here and uh, get to do YouTube lives and stuff because I don't do YouTube lives anymore because I uh, have to do them here on mom's computer in house. Um, the only time I do YouTube lives now is when I'm out in the field somewhere, you know, in the, either in the excavator in the combine, we've done a few, but I uh, can't really do them at home because I just don't have the internet service. So uh, we're gonna keep painting. We'll show you a few tricks that we figured out to make painting this easier, like painting around the ceiling and stuff. I'll show you how I done that. So give you a little backstory on how we started this project, I suppose. So it's going to be a short video today, but I figured better make a video. I mean, yesterday was a complete disaster. I mean, it was 8 degrees, feller buncher didn't want to start. It's designed to start where where normal equipment shouldn't run, up in the north. But uh, we finally got it running, got it moved to the next job, got the excavator moved. So, anyways, let's keep painting and see what we can get done today. <coughs> Okay, so Dad, Strength, and I have moved on to painting in the uh, the office area. 
So I, my job is to paint around the top and keep the paint off the trim. So I'm going to show you how I achieve this. Pretty simple. I've uh, just got me a taping knife for drywall right here. And I've got one of these paint sponges. Going to work real nice. So what I do, let me get the paint. Just I like, go up here with the taping knife Ouch. and I shove it up under the trim. Oh, where am I? Poke it up under the trim like this, pry the trim out, and then go under here and paint it. like so. Pull my taping knife out and I've got a nice clean edge there. Shove it up under it again. Right up. <clears throat> That's all there is to it. Makes it a lot faster than taping everything off. And it makes it a lot faster than having to wipe everything off if you get paint on it. So I can quickly do this. I'll go around the room, I get that done, and then Dad Strength will come along with the paint roller and he'll paint it. Okay, so we decided since we have a blank canvas basically, we're gonna go full Bob Ross on this wall and uh, we're gonna paint a nice mural of something with a surprise for Dad and on his shop off this wall. So uh, let's get started. I got some paint here. I think we're going to paint a picture of a tractor here. You know? we get a wheel, with a small front wheel here, and we're just going to, you know, Bob Ross it up. Not sure which uh, tractor we're going to make here. I, I don't know. Let's, that kind of looks like the 4430. That is Dad's favorite tractor. Hang it on the wall there. Get this exhaust. Add, add a little more color. Let's see some suitcase weights here. And, you know, a fender exhaust. Yeah, three point hitch on. Yeah, and then dad inside. Yeah. That's a nice tractor there. Okay, so I guess some happy little trees over here above it. You know, there might be a hill behind it. Like, yeah, there we go. Yeah. Happy little cloud, yeah. How, how's that look? It looks good. Look I think good. you'll like it. I, I think you'll like it too. So I'm going to get this finished up and then uh, we'll get a picture after what it looks like. Okay, so the picture is done on the wall and it turned out great. I really like it. I can't wait to show dad. He's really going to like it. It looks really cool. So uh, now we're going to head to lunch and uh, on my way out, I'll show you the rest of the break room and show you how the paint turned out on it. So we got a little touch up to do yet. We need to give it a whole nother coat and then some touch up around the edges, but everything looks really good. I really like the way this color pops. It's gonna be really nice in here when we get the cabinets in, get the shelves in, get the refrigerator and all that. So uh, I think we got enough video for this uh, video for today. I don't wanna make it too long. I don't wanna bore everybody, but I figured I'd give a little office update video because a few guys have asked about it and I thought, well, it's a good day to do it. It's too cold outside to work. It don't look like it's cold out, but it is cold out there. It's like, it's like eight degrees right now. So definitely not gonna be doing any excavating work today. So uh, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, give me a like, I'd greatly appreciate it. And thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.